in ancient times, Gale Crater rippled with the fresh, blue water of a large lake. It is now a 90-mile wide hole in the surface of Red Mars. His water is gone, but the sediments left behind contain clues as to when and where the planet might once have been hospitable to life. The Curiosity rover has been pursuing those tracks since 2012. Strolling around Gale Crater and moving slowly up to the three-mile high of Sharp Mount at its center, Curiosity is studying the layers of rock that the lake established in the weather. Today, a new analysis of the rover's findings reveals the red planet had the physics, chemistry, and energy ingredients to sustain life between 3.8 and 3.1 billion years ago. That's just the moment life began on Earth and it's a bigger window than the scientists previously assumed. To reconstruct the red planet's past climate, Hurwitz and his team measured the amount of aluminum contained in each layer, compared to minerals like sodium and calcium that easily leach into the rock. During heat conditions, water is better at dissolving and chemically modifying rocks. So if a layer of rock has a lot of aluminum, but not much sodium or calcium, it indicates that it formed in warm conditions. Cold water is not as chemically active, so a layer of rock with an increased abundance of sodium and calcium suggests the layer formed under warm conditions. The rocks suggest that Mars was initially cold, and then became warm and humid. Over time it has dried up due to a catastrophic loss of its atmosphere, but new results indicate that the tempered Mars weather was longer lived than scientists expected. 